This story is about a new innovation that aims to help individuals with mobility impairments, such as wheelchair users who are often at a disadvantage when traveling to a new place. But this Indian startup has a solution to the problem. It is empowering the differently abled with the freedom to move around independently. Watch this story for more details. According to the World Health Organization, about 15% of the world's population lives with some form of disability. In India, disabled people constitute around 5% of the country's population. People with disabilities struggle with even basic activities that we usually take for granted, like standing, walking and running. While wheelchairs are there to help people with mobility issues to move around and enjoy the outdoors, they usually require another person's help. Moreover, the strength required to move a traditional wheelchair and the limitation to cover long distances are some of its other downsides. Electric wheelchairs, on the other hand, are more effective, but they are very heavy and not particularly portable. Enter Neobolt. Neobolt is said to be India's first indigenous motorized wheelchair vehicle. In other words, it's a wheelchair that doubles up as an electric scooter. Developed by India's prestigious institute IIT Madras, Neobolt combines a motor-powered attachment and the wheelchair called Neofly. Both Neobolt and Neofly are being commercialized under Neomotion, an IIT Madras incubated startup. The key of our product is the simplicity and ease with which Neofly and Neobolt could be attached. The two, the two vehicles could be joined. And we have come up with an uh, attachment mechanism which can be implemented very quickly. So the user, without taking anybody's help, uh, joins the products in just 5 to 10 seconds time. They can attach it to their wheelchair on their own independently. Uh, they can go out of their house on their own, go to the market, go to their office and do all the activities on their own without taking anybody's help. Interestingly, Neobolt is referred to as an all-terrain motorbike, which means it can be used to climb a steep hill with its gradient-supported mobility or be driven through the pothole streets. Neobolt basically helps wheelchair users move around independently, anywhere and anytime. Nearly 95% of all wheelchairs sold in India are one-size-fits-all. This restricts mobility and could be detrimental to health. However, Neomotion hopes to change this. Neofly is a customizable wheelchair which is built according to the user. Based on their body measurements and health assessment, we fit it to the end user so that they have a great posture, there is no shoulder or back pain, propelling it is very smooth and they can go very easily into small lifts, small bathrooms and so on. For outdoor mobility, we built Neobolt, which is an add-on which converts the wheelchair to a bike. They don't need to shift from their wheelchair to any other vehicle. They can simply attach it and go outdoors on roads without taking anybody's help. But here is an important question. How safe is Neobolt? All the Typical features that are present in a road vehicle uh, like rear view mirror, horn, lights are present on it. It's equipped with a seat belt. There are anti-tippers which prevent the device from tipping sideways or backsides. Uh, there is a very rigorous standard for roadworthiness testing uh, certified by ISO and that gives us the confidence that the product is safe to be driven on roads. An average wheelchair is typically priced around 10,000 rupees in India. That's approximately $120. And an electric wheelchair costs anywhere between 45,000 and 80,000 Indian rupees, which is around $550 to $970. So how much does a Neobolt cost? Neofly and Neobolt are priced at 1 lakh rupees. It's also available in EMI, where one can buy in installments of 6 to 7,000 rupees a month. Neobolt is priced at 1 lakh Indian rupees. We wish it was priced a tad lower. According to the company, products with features comparable to Neobolt are available only in the global market and they are at least 3 to 5 times more expensive. 
Neobolt is doing its bit to help people with special needs belonging to the economically weaker section. We have launched an initiative called uh, Livelihood on Wheels. We have partnered with multiple uh, food delivery uh, companies and now these wheelchair users are doing food deliveries and they're able to earn about 15 to 20,000 rupees a month. Uh, close to 100 users have been placed and the goal is to uh, increase the number as high as possible and have as many wheelchair users deployed across India so that they can start earning uh, on their own. This invention appears to be promising. We think the disability landscape in India needs more such functional and assistive devices.